Hey guys, today I'm going to show you some keyboard shortcuts for Notepad. The first one I want to show you is how to open a note that you've previously worked on. To do that, I'm going to click Ctrl and O at the same time. So as you can see, that goes to open. I'm not actually going to open anything, so I'm just going to cancel out of this. Alright, so now I'm going to type out a sentence. And now I'm going to click on Ctrl and S at the same time. As you can see, it goes to Save As, and you would type in the name of the document down here. So I'm just going to call it Hello, and I'm going to click on Save. Next, I'm going to click on Ctrl and N, which is going to go to New. So what that's actually going to do is close out of the current document and open a blank page. Next, I'm going to click on Ctrl and P. As you can see, this goes to the print screen, and I'm just going to cancel out of that. Now if I click on Ctrl Z, it will undo what I just did. Now I'm going to highlight this part, and I'm going to click on Ctrl X. Now what this is going to do is cut, so as you can see the text disappears. Now I'm going to undo what I just did. I can do that by either clicking Ctrl Z, which is undo or I can click on Control V which is paste. So I'm going to press Control V. Now I'm going to highlight this again and click on Control C. Now what this is going to do is copy. So now I've copied that to the clipboard. I'm going to press enter a few times and I'm going to click on Control V again. This is going to paste it onto the next line. I'm going to highlight this once more and now I'm going to click on DEL which is the delete key. Now I'm going to put the cursor at the first of the sentence, and I'm going to click on Control F. This opens Find. Now what this is going to allow me to do is search for a particular word throughout this note. Once I've typed in the word I'm looking for, I'm going to click on Find Next. As you can see, what that does is it highlights that word in the note. Now if this was a longer note, and I had that word written more than once, all I would have to do is click on Find Next again, and then it would go to the next occurrence of that word in this note. But I don't have any more than that, so I'm just going to cancel. Next, I'm going to click on Control H, and this is going to open Replace. Now, this is a bit similar to Find, so what you would do is type in the word you're looking for in the top here, and then down here, you would write the word you'd like to replace it with. So right now, in Find What, it says How, I'm going to go ahead and backspace that, and I'm going to type in U question mark. And then down here, I'm going to type in U today question mark. And I'm going to click on find next. So now U question mark is highlighted, and if I click on replace, it changes it to U today question mark. Next, I'm going to click on control and A. That's the keyboard shortcut for select all. So as you can see, it's highlighted everything written on the page. I'm just going to undo that. Now if I click on F5, it will insert the date and time. As you can see, it says 8.02 a.m. 2015, 03.20. So that's what time it is, and that's today's date. As you can see, it's the same down here. I'm just going to go ahead and undo that. So I'm going to click on Control and Z. So those were some useful keyboard shortcuts for Notepad. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial, and I'll see you in my next video.